Welcome to week five, day five, second grade for reading. Today we are going to read this story about Mamoroto or Mamotaro. Mamotaro. As you read this Japanese folktale, pay close attention to the problem and how the problem is resolved. Okay, so read the story. Then you're going to write down the problem. Tell who tried to fix it and did anyone help? How did they try to solve the problem and did it work? So re the resolution, how did the, how did the story end? What happened at the end? Did you like the ending? Why or why not? So you just have to answer those questions for reading after you read the story. For writing, you are going to um, pretend that you found a secret door in your house. Write a paragraph, so three to four sentences, telling us where did it lead to, that secret door. Describe things you saw in that secret door. And would you tell anyone else? And maybe tell me why you would tell someone else or why you would not tell someone else. Okay, so that is re uh, writing for grammar on this day. You are going to complete the sentences by changing the verbs in parentheses to the, to the present tense verbs. The first one's done for you. Okay, so Pippa build a sandcastle when we go to the beach. They are showing you that build needs to turn to builds when you are talking in the present tense okay so um i basically you're going to be adding s but boys and girls you're going to have to remember what rules we learned this past week if it ends in a um a y you need to look at the letter before it to see is it a vowel if the letter before it is a vowel, you can just add S. If the letter before it is a consonant, you need to change the Y to an I and then add ES, okay? So there are some in there, some words that you are going to have to change, okay? You will have to change some of those words. Some of them do have a Y and a consonant at the end, okay? Some of them have a Y and just a vowel, and in that case, you just add S, okay? Other ones, you will have to change the Y to an I and add ES, okay? That is grammar. You'll have to turn your iPad sideways again on that one. And for math, you're doing some more uh, uh, place value, okay? So you are going to write these numbers 1 through 10. They are in expanded form right now. You're going to write them in uh, the form that goes together smaller. I'm forgetting what that is um, called, okay? But put in the numbers normally how they would be if you were writing them. And then on the bottom, one through 10, is your, when you're writing them in expanded form, okay? So just how these first ones are is gonna be what your answers look like on the top and how these first ones are is what it's going to look like on your answers on the bottom, all right? Okay, so have a good day with this, boys and girls. I hope it, your work has been pretty easy. Once again, if you get bored, you can do other fun things when you get done, but make sure you get your work, other work done before you do the fun things. And boys and girls, if you have any questions, please do not hesitate to message me. And if you need to ask on Zoom meetings, I can set up a Zoom meeting with you as well. Have a good day.